you could switch her placement for three days. Oh, okay. So everyone comfortable with this when you're at your back office, how to get to this page? Because some, I mean, sometimes it can be hard to even find this part of the back office. Yeah. Okay. So under my business, you go to my downline, uh -huh. my graphical genealogy, and that's where you'll see uh, yeah. your mom probably went either at the first spot on one of them or she went under a bunch of other coaches. So that'll tell you whether she went on your strong leg or your weak leg. Okay. I think she went on my strong leg because it still says I have zero on my weak leg. So I think that that is, that's okay for you because if she's going to, um, just be a discount coach and not be, since she's your mom, you might not be building her business as if you were building your spouse's or a partner's business because right. you're a bank account. So like my mom is a discount coach and I had to work her business for a little bit because I had to switch Alex's placement. So she can be there if there is like, say you're diamond. What happened with me? I was diamond and I lost my rank. And, uh, my mom was one of my discount coaches and I was able to make her emerald so that I would gain diamond back. So it kind of sucked because she's going to get a 1099 with some income that I technically got. But, um, if it's just a straight discount coach, the only thing that I would make sure is that you start to balance your discount coaches that aren't going to be a business you're going to work so that they're not all on one leg. Okay. You know, kind of sprinkle them throughout, but it's good she's on your strong leg because you, if she was going to be generating volume, you'd want her on your weak leg. Okay. So good to think if you wanted to throw your fiance on your weak leg just for the forty dollars sign up, uh -huh. so that it so that it it saves this place for him. If someone would have explained this to me in the beginning, Alex would be at the top. So then this whole tree would have been built underneath him. And all of that volume then could start to, if, if you get to a place in your business where you want to make your spouse emerald because you could get to diamond that way, uh -huh. uh, it, it would be really beneficial because they're already placed in this grid of all of these people. So I waited to sign Alex up because we were broke and I couldn't afford it. Uh -huh. But now I'm a little bit frustrated. I'm having to like do a lot more work when I could have just paid the $40 and at least got him on even as inactive mm -hmm. and had him at least placed in this, in this whole situation. So, so your mom will show up on one side and then the other side will show up um, like this little red dotted outline uh -huh. where your next person will go. So it'll just it'll just naturally alternate between your left and your right. Okay. And unless you set it. So um, you know, there may come a time when you have two or three people signing up at once and you you're like, ah, I need to know, you know, and you just have to express to those people that you have to make sure that they're signing up in the correct position in your business. And so you need to know the minute you need to know when they're sitting at the computer and signing up. Because one might be a discount, one might be a really strong coach, and I'm always here to walk you guys through all of those when someone's signing up. Don't be afraid to text me or message me on Facebook or anything because it's really important for you to get to place them right so that um, you know you're getting the most for what out of what you're doing. Yeah.